Hey, Dr. Henry here with Techstar Chiropractic. I want to talk to you a little bit today about the spinal adjustment or a chiropractic adjustment. And that's probably the most common thing you think of when you think of a chiropractor is the spinal mobilization or adjustment. And that's where you hear the pop or the click. Uh, that's kind of the biggest thing that we're known for and the thing that we've been doing the longest. Um, now, chiropractors nowadays use all kinds of different treatment approaches to treat musculoskeletal disorders, which are problems with your joints, your muscles, your spine, your nerves. Uh, but the big thing is still based on spinal adjustments and mobilization. And so what that is is where we go in and we actually manually adjust or mobilize the spine. Now, we have different ways of doing that. We can do that by hand. We can use instruments. Uh, we can use tables to help us to mobilize things without having to use much force. And there's even low force techniques where we can just use muscle mobilization around the joint to get the joint moving. The thing that ties all this together is what we're trying to accomplish, and that's mobilizing and getting normal function back into a joint. So when a joint's restricted or has had pressure on it in lots of different ways or, or postural issues or any number of things that can cause injury or dysfunction uh, and it's not moving correctly, the spinal mobilization comes in and it actually creates movement in that joint. Now, not a lot of movement, but enough movement to where the joint can start to function more freely. And the more the, junction, the joint functions correctly, the less pain and irritation you get. So whether it's an arthritic joint or an acute injury, providing mobilization provides pain relief and it also restores normal function. Um, I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna actually show you a cervical spine adjustment. And what that is where we adjust someone's neck. And you're gonna see a video of that in just a moment. The thing I want you to remember is that all the docs here at Techstar Chiropractic, as well as all licensed chiropractors, have gone to school for at least seven, if not eight years to get their degrees. Uh, and it's one of the things that's really important to keep it safe. Um, it's a safe procedure when done with someone who's trained correctly. It can be dangerous if done at home, so do not try this at home. We've got Janine, one of our favorite patients here in the office with us, and we're gonna go ahead and demonstrate a cervical adjustment. So like we talked about, what we're trying to do is to put motion back into restricted joints, and by doing that, we can create some pain relief and also restore some normal biomechanics of these joints, and that's really how we get a lot of the improvement we see with cervical adjusting, or really with adjusting throughout the whole spine. So what I'm gonna do is a seated adjustment right here today. I'm gonna to do a, a manual adjustment, so a by hand adjustment. So I'm gonna come through and I'm gonna check the alignment and just how these joints are moving. Now we've already x-rayed Janine and we know what's going on in there uh, from an anatomy standpoint, but we're looking for the daily changes on which joints get fixated. And so we'll bring our head back and it's a very gentle for us, just like that, and we'll get some good movement there. Now another way that we adjust necks if we need to is using something called an arthro step, and that's a, an instrument assisted adjusting. And so what we do is come through here and we're gonna check each joint and just put a little motion into it. And by doing that, we fire the mechanoreceptors, the little nerves inside the joint space, uh, which allows the body to start to loosen up those joints as well. Thanks.